Hello everyone, I'm Ishihara from the Pokemon Company. February 27th is the date Pokemon Red and Pokemon Green were released in Japan, marking the beginning of the Pokemon series. An astounding 25 years have passed since the Pokemon series was born. We've shared so much with you over the past 25 years, through our games, but also through so many other mediums, thanks to the support you've all shown us. Thank you, each and every one of you. Today, Mr. Utsunomiya will introduce our latest updates. Hello there, my name is Utsunomiya from the Pokemon Company. First, I'd like to give you the latest update on the new Pokemon Snap game. We've put together a video that will show you some of the gameplay. Please have a look. Welcome to the world of new Pokemon Snap. This is the Lentil region. You'll ride the Neo 1 through the jungle, across the desert, and even under the sea to research Pokemon in their natural habitats. And of course, you won't be alone. Professor Mirror, who's doing research in the Lentil region, and research team members Rita and Phil are there to support you. So you're in good hands. Now then, let's get that research started. By watching wild Pokemon, you can discover behaviors and expressions that are rarely seen. Look, a surfing Alolan Raichu. And there's Vaporeon. Let's try throwing it a fluff fruit. That's it. Now's our chance. Oh, it's Tyranitar. What a wild way to eat. Here's a park at night. Let's try playing a melody. Oh, that sure made Hoot Hoot happy. You'll also have Illumina Orbs, something the professor invented. If you use one of these, you can make any Pokemon glow. Whoa, those flames changed color. Make good use of your tools to take shots that really stand out. Then, show the photos you took to the professor. Oh, four stars! We captured a rare moment there. Catch a variety of different behaviors on camera to fill up your Pokemon photo decks. And there's more! You'll be able to edit the photos you've taken. Use features like stickers and frames to make your favorite photos even more special. And I'm sure you'll want to show off your best photos, right? We know that feeling well. When you want to do that, it's time to go online. You can share your favorite photos and check out photos from around the world. And if your photo becomes popular, it might even be featured and get more attention. Seeing something like that may inspire you to go back and take even more photos. We're getting closer to the start of your adventure. Unexplored islands and plenty of Pokemon await in the Lentil region. So make sure you're prepared. Whoa, is that the mythical Pokemon Celebi? Get ready, the Lentil region is waiting for you. What did you think? I hope you're looking forward to the game's release on April 30th. Next, I'd like to tell you about several events we're holding to celebrate Pokemon Day. In the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield games, special Max Raid battles featuring Gigantamax Pikachu are underway. And in Pokemon Cafe Mix, we're holding a promotion in which you can receive 2,500 Golden Acorns for logging in. In Pokemon Go, Articuno, Zapdos, Moltres, and even Mewtwo are appearing in Legendary Raid Battles as part of a Kanto-themed celebration event. In Pokemon Masters EX, Galar Region Champion Leon and his partner Pokemon Charizard will arrive at last. 
We hope you'll enjoy these events. Next, I'd like to present the latest news about the Pokemon video game series. Have a look at this video. This is a tale from a long, long time ago, when the Sinnoh region was still only a vast wilderness. A certain village bustled with the comings and goings of people, while in the mountains and seas, Pokémon roamed as they pleased. I'm pleased to announce two new additions to the Pokémon video game series, both taking place in the Sinnoh region. First, I'd like to present the Pokémon Brilliant Diamond and Pokémon Shining Pearl games. These are faithful remakes of the Pokémon Diamond version and Pokémon Pearl version games, which were released for the Nintendo DS system in Japan 15 years ago. Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl games, remakes of the Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pearl version games which were released for the Nintendo DS system, 
are coming to Nintendo Switch. These games will be developed by Ilka Inc., who also worked on Pokemon Home. The project is being directed by Yuichi Ueda of Ilka, as well as Game Freak's Junichi Masuda, who was the director for the original Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pro version games. Your adventure will take place in the Sinnoh region. Rich in nature and with towering Mount Coronet at its heart, it is a land of many myths passed down through the ages. The sense of scale of the original game's towns and roots has been carefully preserved, and you'll be able to travel through familiar locations once again. You'll set out on your journey after choosing either Turtwig, Chimchar, or Piplup as your first partner Pokémon. In these games, you can enjoy a grand adventure together with all the Pokémon from Pokémon Diamond version and Pokémon Pearl version. Newcomers and previous visitors to the Sinnoh region alike can look forward to experiencing the original Pokémon Diamond and Pokémon Pearl stories, freshly recreated for Nintendo Switch. What did you think? Pokémon Brilliant Diamond and Pokémon Shining Pearl will launch simultaneously around the world late this year. We hope you're all excited for a nostalgic yet fresh adventure in the Sinnoh region. Next, allow me to introduce you to the Pokémon Legends Arceus game. Pokémon Legends Arceus represents a new approach for the Pokémon video game series. Development is in full swing at Game Freak, with the aim to deliver a gaming experience that breaks new ground for the Pokémon series. Please have a look at this video. The events of this game unfold in the Sinnoh of old. In this time, too, Mount Coronet towers over the center of the region. Pokémon live freely in the wild here, but the harsh environments may be different from the Sinnoh region you remember. In this era, people have journeyed to Sinnoh from all over and founded a prosperous village in the hope of learning more about this land. As for these three Pokémon, Rowlet, Cyndaquil, and Oshawott, it seems they were brought to Sinnoh by a certain professor who encountered them while traveling around various regions. You'll set off on your adventure after receiving a first partner Pokémon of your own from this professor. With the village as your base, you'll venture out to the different corners of the region on your quest to create Sinnoh's very first Pokédex. Even in this era, wild Pokémon can be caught with Pokéballs. You can also engage in Pokémon battles alongside your Pokémon allies. Sharpen your skills for both catching and battling Pokémon and strive to complete your Pokédex. Now for the mythical Pokémon that graces the game's title and story, Arceus. According to legend, Arceus shaped all there is in this world. But how is this Pokémon connected to your journey? The answer to this question and more awaits you in this exciting new action RPG adventure for the Nintendo Switch system. Pokémon Legends Arceus will launch simultaneously around the world early next year. We hope you're all excited to set out on these adventures across the Sinnoh region, each one distinctly different from the other, with the wonderfully nostalgic Pokémon Brilliant Diamond and Pokémon Shining Pearl, as well as the Pokémon video game series' new journey, Pokémon Legends Arceus. As Pokémon celebrates 25 years, we will continue to challenge ourselves and deliver new ways for everyone to enjoy Pokémon even more. Thank you very much for watching.